All right. Then kind of the last example here, high A, right? Low B and C and a slightly high D. These are amazing problem solvers, right? Critical thinkers, right? How do I make things more efficient, more effective? All of that, really good. Super outcome oriented, also structured, diligent, are gonna get things right. What's hard? They have super high standards for themselves and others that could be hard to meet. And again, they might have a little bit of disdain for fluff and feelings and all the emotional stuff or the communicative stuff that doesn't feel substance-based to them, right? Um, what are they like? Written in advance, but look at that low C. Get right to the point, right? Just enough for sure. And avoid the small talk and warming them up and buttering them up. They don't like it. Just get to the substance and you can be super direct with them as they are going to be with others, right? And where do they shine a lot of times? Process, structure, standards, ways to do things, and then implementing it with excellence, even if it's unpopular or difficult, right? This is right. This is correct. Others don't like it. They say too bad for them, right? So they can be very straightforward and kind of forces of nature in that way, uh, for sure. So hopefully that could be helpful in terms of just some examples of what different kinds of patterns might need when you think about this.